What's leak me? I have just come from the depths. The Iron Man is a long-time celebrated tradition in which a bunch of really athletic people try to outrace each other with bikes and swimming to see who's the most athletic Adonis of them all. The Iron Man is the hardest triathlon known to man. It starts off with a swim, then goes into a bike, then you finish off with a hard, intense run. The distance of the swim portion of the Ironman is 3.86 kilometers. The distance of the bike portion of the Ironman is 180.2 kilometers. And then the distance for the final run portion of the Ironman is... Is 42.4 kilometers. Now that's some real damage. In kilometers is very significant to the success and well being of the participants in the Iron Man. If the kilometers went over this amount, people's lives could potentially be in danger. The amount of kilometers taken for the race is perfect for a challenge. Most men, women, and others do not have the iron will to complete or train for the Iron Man. The sexiest course in the world. <laughs> the current Iron Man course has put me in a box of discomfort. I hate life now. It's been a hard six years. But with these new gradients, these new topographic profiles, this new course, I will find joy in the Iron Man again. I believe Iron Man can be great again. Make Iron Man great again. With a new and improved course, the Iron Man will be more challenging, more invigorating, more stimulating than ever. Not just stimulating for the participants, but for the viewers. An improved The course will be more challenging than ever. Sporadic. We will show these athletes what the Iron Man is about. They finally know what it's like to die on the inside. Because the inside is what matters most. So, how is this course different from the original Iron Man course? The answer is, the measurements are different, as well as the map direction of for those of you who don't know, a gradient is like the slope of a graph. It is a change in elevation from one point to another over the course of the unit race. This course has different gradients than the original course. The original unit rate is meters over kilometers. Our top scientist recorded the following changes. The swim section of the map has a constant gradient of zero because its elevation never changes. The bike section of the map goes through many changes. Zero, 30, 36. 33, 20, and 10. All of these measurements suggest an unsteady and unsettling change for each of the races participants. These sporadic changes will surely make the course much more invigorating. As for the run section of the map, it has well as many changes in its gradients. 30, 40, 20, and 31 more. Having changes within a range of 20 meters Change in 